Yo, what's good guys? Slightly different kind of format of the video, or I don't know what the word is, but I don't know if any of you guys remembered, but back when I was living at the last place I was living at, uh, the shared old care home thing that used to be a care home, and before I even reacted to Murder House, Asylum and Coven and Freak Show, I actually had a friend round called Sam, and we were going to react to hotel together uh i just i'd actually just finished watching the haunting of hill house so i wanted to introduce like a duo slash dual reaction with a friend of mine uh we actually we started to watch uh episode one of hotel i uploaded it to patreon and I uploaded it to youtube but i had a lot of comments saying that they would uh people would like me to have started from season one murder house so that's really how it came about, me starting from Murder House and then doing it in order, reacting to it in order. And now that I finally got to Hotel, I was going to react to Hotel with Sam, my friend. But a coronavirus is happening and the whole country's in lockdown and we can't, we can't actually see each other. We were thinking of doing it over Skype, but that would just be too much editing he would have to send me webcam footage of him or unless we did it on discord or something but even then like we would have to play hotel at the exact same time and it, it does make a lot of difference when there's like jump scares and stuff because if one of us is ahead then we're gonna know it's coming even if it's like one one or two seconds prior i've re-edited the hotel episode one footage with sam and i'm gonna upload that to Patreon and YouTube. It actually got done for copyright on YouTube because of the Hotel California song. That kind of pissed me off because it was fine for like four or five days on YouTube and then out of nowhere the video got taken down for copyright for Hotel California. And the previous version that was on Patreon was only um, the reaction. It wasn't the, it didn't include the intro and the outro like the review. So I've managed to fit that in, edited it down and it should be good to go i'm just making this video now just so you guys know like oh what the fuck's going on like you're in different surroundings like when did you move there like no this was last year when i had sam round and reacted to episode one and in the intro you're gonna hear me say like i've never watched american horror story like obviously that was true back then but obviously i'm caught up now to freak show i've finished watching freak show now i'm on a hotel but unfortunately, episode one of Hotel is just going to be a one-off with Sam because obviously we can't see each other and there's no way for us to record it together. So from episode two and onwards on Hotel, it's just going to be me again. Same as before. So yeah, I just thought I'd give you guys a heads up on that. I um, hope you're all doing well during the lockdown. It's been over a month and it's starting to take its toll, if I'm, if I'm being honest. Anyway... I'm going to play the whole reaction from the beginning, so the intro and stuff. But yeah, I just wanted to make this little video just to clarify some things. And I hope you understand what's going on now. So, I'll now take you to the past Chazman and the past Sam. Where we react to episode one of Hotel. So, enjoy. Sorry. <laughs> <laughs> Yo, what's up guys? Welcome back to another reaction. Um... I thought I'd do something a little special today. I'm going to do a little jewel reaction with my friend Sam here. Hello. So we're on Hotel, obviously he's seen the first four or something, and I've not actually seen American Horror Story. But well, he's yeah. he's clarified to me that... First four American Horror is not uh, the first four Hotel ones. I, haven't, I barely saw the first, half of the first episode of this season that we're about to watch because... <laughs> it made him gag, he Yeah, said. there was a scene <laughs> in there. He's going to throw up. <laughs> there was a scene in there that just... <laughs> really unsettled me we're reacting to the whole series anyway so yeah stick not all around. tonight stick around you might enjoy it i'll turn your heater off for a bit the heat on heat it off for a bit it's off bruv is it yeah Can I open the window all right so this is called so season five episode one of american horror story this one's called checking in an hour and two minutes long Beautiful. Whoa, 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 where is this? It's New York, mate. No, it's not. Universal Studios. 
New York, get out of here. He, that's what they're saying. He just said it's New York. He doesn't. That they're they're stupid. Oh, actually, it's in LA. Apologies. Nice hotel. Is it? I don't know. I like hotels with a bit more. It's a bit of, dark. <laughs> yeah, I don't know. I like hotels when they're a bit a bit too red. Friendly. It doesn't seem very friendly to me. I mean, hell no. That would just tell you to fuck right off at that place and never come back, wouldn't it? No, oh, fuck. How did that scare you? What was <laughs> doing is pointing, bro. It's the noise, man. Oi. That would not be my first port of call. I'd leave it, bro. I wouldn't go for that noise. No. <laughs> oh! Jesus Christ. Like me and had the cap on a Monday. Oh my god, there's someone eating her! That's why you don't have kids. Is this the one? <laughs> this is the one you gagged at. You know what? It's your lucky day. Mama's feeling magnanimous. Hmm. It's your lucky day, huh? Room 64. I bet it's her making the calls. It just makes you think it's a man on the phone. Yeah, obviously it's not a man. Oh, elevator's out of service I don't think. Today. I don't know. <laughs> oh, fuck! Jesus Christ! <laughs> Your reactions scare me more when than anything. Die, they saw the sheets, blood, shit, urine. I can take care of every stain there is. Don't look there, I don't want to see. Is it an old woman? <laughs> oh, he got raped by a knife. <laughs> That's actually making you gag. Bro, he's getting it in the arts with a knife. What's she gonna do if that's not the worst of it? Well, you can see it in the background, look, the mirror. <laughs> Jesus Christ. Holden? Was that his kid? He's buzzing, isn't he? <laughs> He's proper He's buzzing. so happy to be there. He's so buzzing. Look at them, they both pulled. Happy days. You can't be so confident as a couple to be able to do this. Do you know what I mean? They must do it all the time if they this. Do you know what I mean? I'd be like, no, well, I don't know. I haven't seen this bit now. That, oh, vampire, so you saw the vampire, that vampire bit. bit was as far as we get, yeah. Really? Yeah, I just, it's, it's not that. It was more, I was still reading over the knife in the arse thing. I was just like, do you know what? I've you were couple. trying to get that out of your head. I've had enough of this. <laughs> I want more! So if I was running away from that, I'd be sneaking because I know that woman's back there. She's gonna lock the doors. I'm not gonna get away though. Whoa! Oh, I thought the old woman was in charge, but it seems not. Mate, if you've got a vampire <laughs> in a hotel, I think they'd be in charge, isn't it?
Why would you ever leave your child anyway? You'd always watch them. You wouldn't walk away from it and just be like, oh. Some people do, man. A child in a very public place, especially in 2010. Trust me, bro, people do it. It's just silly if you ask me. Well, do it with very clear to me the art world has looked to LA you've and seen, fashion you've seen, you've seen, you've seen, 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 seen I haven't seen this bro I only saw up to the vampire but even then I don't remember it that's the rapper so much energy how can I help what? you? See, I would totally be saying to him right now, uh, I saw something, something horrible. Like, I would just be keeping that to myself. We'll let you know if we need anything. The lights! That's the vampire. Yeah. Who the hell are you people? I thought... Oh, the light, yeah. Yeah, but it. I thought UV actually burned them. What are you doing in my room? I lived in New York many years ago. I loved roaming the streets. Devouring the pulse of the city. <laughs> Devouring the pulse of the city. Oh, oh that's when I was born. When we were born. So this is 16 years before the kid got taken. Yeah. Well, she can't be a vampire. She went up Oh, now she's dead. Yeah, but then, what's her name? Lady M Lady Gaga's boyfriend was fine in the sun, didn't he? Oh. Mm. So that was a bare long episode. Did you like it? Yeah, I liked it. There's a lot of um there's a lot of side stories other than a main story. You don't know what the main story is yet. I'm guessing it's the guy. It's a bit tricky. I mean, with a lot of them, you don't really, like I said, you don't really figure out what's going on. What I found in the series until it leaves you guessing, obviously, and that's what most good series do. They leave you guessing until like halfway through the last. And because it's horror as well, like there it wasn't was so really a horror many... for me. It was more. No, I know. It was but... a more of a thriller. Yeah, but it will turn into a horror. I mean, there'll be more stuff. I don't. Th yeah. Well, time will tell. Well, I don't also, think it will. What's your definition? What's a horror for you? Do you know what I mean? Everyone's definition of a horror is different. Well, the Haunting of Hill House was definitely a horror, man. Yeah, it's paranormal. It's a horror, yeah. But then, like, I thought they had this had vampires in. This had lots of blood. This had a guy who had no eyes, nothing, but it was just skin and a, a knife. Ah, uh, I say that's a thriller, man. No well, one's a thriller. No, a thriller. A thriller. I don't think a thriller can be like non-realistic. Like that was not real life. Talk, like, when's the last time you've met a man with no features on him but has a metal penis that is like a knife? Do you know what I mean? Or, well, vamp or vampires? We'll agree to disagree, man. I don't think it's all right. I don't know. I, I personally don't think... I know it's, called, it's called American Horror I, I mean, I didn't find it scary. I just found it a bit, like, gruesome. And, like... Yeah. Do you know what I mean? Like, it was a bit... The ideas were a bit, like, ugh. I would say that's a horror. That horror for me is meant to be scary. What would you say Saw was a horror? No. Yeah. So so for you, it wasn't scary, therefore so far, it's not been a horror. If I had to say. Yeah. I but only it, got scared of the jump scares. Yeah, I know. So there might be episodes further on that you do find scary. Maybe, so maybe, yeah, in the, maybe individually, not. you've got to say, oh, this is the horror episode, this isn't... But yeah. I mean, I would, it's called American I, Horror I would, Story for a reason. <laughs> Yeah, but I wouldn't say, it would, for me, the ideas were scary, but like, just gruesome and not really, it wasn't like, oh, on the edge of my seat, putting my hand behind my eyes and stuff. Yeah. You yeah. didn't do that once. So let's have a little um, review. Yep. So my take on it was, I can actually feel there was a bit of tension between Kathy Bates' character and the blonde woman. I knew, I knew there was a bit of... Blonde woman, do you mean... Sally? The crimped hair. Yeah. Yeah. There was a bit of like tension between those two, especially with the two Swedish girls. Mm -hmm. And then it flashed back to she actually drugged her son. And then there, they, he became a vampire. It's still not clear yet as to what she her role is. She's just the secretary. Oh, no, I get it now. Because she said, I can't leave because I need to watch over you. And he can never, he can't die now, can he? He can't age. 
the sun. And on the way up, do you remember by the front door yeah. he said, you need to leave, you need to get over it? Yeah, I'm still, yeah, I guess. That's so, why she's so there. So then do you think Lady Gaga and the crimped person are like sisters then? Maybe, yeah, they're both vampires, or, definitely, because she or survived the maybe fall. not, because the crimped hair implied it's quite 80s, so maybe she was turned into a vampire in the 80s. Who? The crimped hair lady. Sally, her name's Sally. Yeah, Sally, because her hair, I don't know, she looks very sort of 80s-esque. Might she be, might have, been, she really might have turned Lady Gaga first. No, maybe. But Lady Gaga's the owner. I don't know, Lady Gaga seems a bit... No, the new owner is William Drake. And he's in on it as well. I don't know, bro. I had to watch the rest of it. There's too many flashbacks. Also, I didn't understand the kids' bit. They all had very, very white hair as well, which is similar to Lady Gaga's hair. So maybe they drink their blood all the time? Like, they keep surprised. They were eating. The two kids were eating someone. Yeah, so they're vampires as well? Maybe, like, they wanted to have children, so they still other people's children, and they've got vampire kids? It's a family-run business, it looks like. It looks like everyone in the hotel, apart from the owner... Well, you don't know yet, because he took over. That might have been... No, very... no, sorry, not apart from the owner. Apart from the person who works on the front desk is a vampire. Baldy. And also Baldy is a vampire. Baldy, we haven't seen much of. Baldy, the, the cross-dresser, we haven't seen much of. Um, not taking the piss out of bald people, by the way. This... No. Don't Gee, know his just, name yet. <laughs> he's, just, he's just bald. He's just got a bald head. He's just head. bald head. Yeah. Yeah. Nothing wrong with being bald. <laughs> Kathy Bates, <laughs> she's, she, seem, she seems like she's been like... She's lost her sort of human side in the sense that she's just like feeding these people. Do you know what I mean? She's getting them ready to feed. She's like, you know, she's trapped the Swedish ladies and was feeding them. Yeah, it's almost stuff. like she's become part of the cult. Like, it's a bit like. The son is... Yeah, it's a bit like there's. Um, have you seen Van Helsing? No. Okay. Igor helping like Dr. Frankenstein and all, all that stuff. Yeah, because she said, I've got to go feed that thing in room 33 yeah we still haven't seen that thing unless oh, it's know, the raper unless... raper boy Maybe. but he's got no and mouth. then who was the person who came from this bed was that another victim was that who was that that's in room 64 yeah but who was that like what was their story why were they in there we'll find out probably next episode because the policeman policeman's an interesting and then what's, what's the whole eye being gouged out thing that's that's uh, the guy on the phone or the woman on the phone. Yeah, I know, but you know what? what what's that? Uh, and then all the intestines and stuff. What is that? Who was supposed? Yeah, to there's a away? lot. There's a lot. I, I'm, I doubt there's going to be a lot of plot holes in this story. I reckon they'll cover it up very well, but so, yeah, obviously not more in the first episode. But things I would be like, yeah, I felt like it was really dark, and obviously they done that for a reason. Um, but at times. It was nice when they went to like they had a little breakaway and they went to like the pier and stuff because it meant What's... it was a bit lighter and it was a bit heavy to watch the whole time. I hope they um, come clearer about it, but I don't get the link between the hotel and the little boy that was taken on the Ferris wheel. Not the Ferris wheel, but the little roundabout thing. Unless they visited the hotel before and they, well, they set eyes on him. No, because yeah, him going missing, Holden going missing, and then Holden, and then it shows you Holden in the game room. Like, in a hotel. That's the reason they're linking. But how do yeah. they see it? How do they see Holden to, to kidnap him? Was it just a random kidnapping? They just saw a random kid on the street. I'm sure they. I'm sure either they eyed him up or or they were out at the Coney Island and they picked him up. I'm sure we'll find out. But they may, maybe they're all out. they all they did was kidnap him because it doesn't seem like they're normal vampires in the sense that they the guy when he was exposed to light didn't start burning up. He was just like he just yeah closed the close it. Or something. So I don't know if that's the case. They clearly can hypnotise people because he a the couple, but also do you remember when he went I'm on a detox, and she went not, not anymore. anymore, and he's like, kind of almost hypnotically, um, and it seems like she did that to children as well, yeah, um, especially to the kids. She was like, we're best of friends, like Lachlan, 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 yeah, Lachlan. We're best of friends now. Yeah, it'd be hope... funny if we see him next episode with white hair. Yeah, that'd be kind of cool. Not I, cool, but... I hope it picks up the pace a little bit, though. It felt a bit... Yeah, every single time it went to a black screen, I was like... <laughs> it felt a bit... I wanted, like, I wanted it to be the ending, but... but yeah, if, and that's that's the sign of something. I, I Whenever I'm thinking, oh, I hope this is the ending, I don't like they, that. They, they dragged it out I too don't want to be thinking. I don't want to be thinking, oh, I hope it's the ending. Like, I know when I go to like uni that I'm having a really good class, so I'm not thinking about the time. Yeah. Do you know what I mean? I'm not thinking about, oh, when's this going to end? I'm just present. And I wasn't present at all during that movie. I was like, well, okay, when's the, when's the next scene? When's the, when's, okay, right. You want like, it to be like Game of Thrones. Like, you want every scene to be not be the end. Yeah, and then you're surprised that it's, oh, what, it's finished already? Like, what? Yeah. 
Um, but I didn't get that vibe with this. But no. hopefully we'll we'll become attached to it. Yeah, maybe also maybe it's just a season, maybe hotel. I thought Lady Gaga's acting was really good. Uh, very Lady Gaga esque. Um, what having sex with randoms and no, <laughs> no, it's just killing him. The sort of gothic, weird, awesome, like wonderfully weird vibe that she gives off. Do you know what I mean? I'd give it like um personally, I'd give it. This is just personal. What out of ten? Yeah. What would you give it? First step. First impressions. First impressions. You've seen episode. it already, haven't you? No, again, Charlie. I've only seen up to that vampire bit, and I turned it off. Yeah, but you're you might count the first time and just count this time. Yeah, I'm, I'm I'm just counting this time. Fresh yeah. start. No, I'm just counting this time because also I I tried I tried to get rid of it in my mind because that episode, that scene with the thing just. I'd away. give it a six point five. Okay. Yeah, I was gonna go for six. Yeah. I was going to go for six. I felt I like there was too many side stories yeah, for me to keep up on. I would go for 6.5 to go for six. I was too bothered by side stories. I was just more bothered, again, by pace and also the overindulgence in in the darkness. Like, I I feel like, I get it's dark, but like I miss, I feel like I'm missing things. I can't see the face properly and I can't see people's expressions properly. And I know it's setting a mood, yeah. but I feel like you're playing that mood too much. You know, you're, 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 you're showing us how we should feel rather than letting us decide it for ourselves. Yeah. Well, that was yeah. fun. It's a good series. I can see it doing good things, but yeah. There was not many <gasps> moments. It was at the start, but then it got... Yeah, it started you getting and me jumped at that bit with um, the hand going through. Yeah, but you'd watch that bit, so you must have known. No, it still scared the shit out of me. Yeah, I guess. Because that man coming through. I found out this episode that it's it's not the actual jump scares, but it's the music that happens when like Mate, the sound. The effects. credits always the credits freak yeah, me out. I'm skipping them. With, from with now each, on, I'm not watching with them. With each of them, I'm not watching them. No, you've got to. I'm skip, no, I'm you've skipping to, the intro, man. It's the same bloody intro. I'm not watching it again. Anyway, thanks guys for watching. Bye. See hope, you. Um, hope you enjoyed. Next time. Uh, if, it was really nice uh, being here for an episode. Um, yeah, thank you for having Hopefully me. Hopefully, the series is going to be a thank you for having me. It's going to be a hit for us, so we're going to we're going to try and wreck to the whole series. But if we I mean, if if we don't like it, then we can yeah. always watch another one. Yeah, and then Charlie's still going to bring out loads of solo ones about with them because you've got to finish various series as well on your own, haven't you? I thought I was going to do the latest American Horror Story on my own, but yeah. I don't know. I don't know yet. We could do that together if we don't like a hotel, but we'll see. Yeah, we might get through a couple of episodes and be like, oh, actually, do you know what? Not our vibe. But it'd be nice to try and commit to something. Anyway, if you guys enjoyed, please give the video a like. It will help. Um, There's no point in giving a dislike. Come on. It helps out. Like. It helps out more than you guys know. And if you yeah. have any tips or anything on other reactions, then leave yeah, it in the comments and, below. Any ideas for things that you'd like to see in videos, or um, you know, if you like Charlotte to wear a bra sometime, you know, things like that. Hey man, if that's what you, you know, know, if, if that you, that's what boat, if that's what you want. That's what you want. We'll give, you know the fans, I mean? we'll give the fans give what the they fans want. Give the fans what they want, you know what I mean? Yeah. All right. And if, that, guys. if you enjoy oh. the content, please do subscribe. Oh, yeah. So definitely hit subscribe wherever it is because he's I'm not going to put it on. That's he's, too fucking, long. he's fucking good and he's. Yeah. Aww. And I, I enjoy watching him. And so. what, one last thing. If you enjoyed this um, small reaction, I don't know how long it's going to be, but I think it's 10 minutes per episode. Yeah. But if you want to watch the full reaction, the full uncut one hour and two, they three minutes. Do that? They can do that. They can do that? <laughs> they can do it on my, on my Patreon account. Oh, yeah. Where I'm going to upload the whole episode. What? You, hang on, they're not... Okay, yeah. With no, with no edits, you're going to see our whole commentary and our reactions through it. Anyway, one last time. Thanks, guys, for watching. Thank you. I've, um, been, I've been Chaz, man. This has been my friend Sam. And take it easy. We'll see you on the next episode. See you later, guys.